Escape to the action at Seminole Casino Hotel in Makalee. It's Vegas style 24 7, because just like Vegas, Seminole Casino Hotel never closes. It's pure entertainment anytime you want, and it's truly where paradise wins. As summer is nearing its end and kids are headed back to the classroom soon, there is still time to save our summer and help put an end to hunger. Back from the Cape Coral Caring Center is Executive Director Julie Ferguson. Good morning. Good morning. Welcome back. Thank you. At first, as soon as I saw you, I said, hey, tell me about your latest event that you just had. Well, we had our summer smackdown. Yes. And we smacked down hunger. We are so happy about that. We tripled um, what we did at our, at our first annual Whoa, summer smackdown. Whoa, did you hear that? Yes. Tripled. We raised six thousand and wow. 4,000 pounds of food, Aww. so that was just awesome. Um, Rotary Clubs of Cape Coral, um, after a very long, <laughs> hard fight, um, did take did take home the belt. So again, right? Again, They're repeat winners. Second annual, yes. Yeah. It, was a, it was a long, hard fight, but they did. So, so you, I know you wanted to give yes. a shout out to them, and you said all the teams though were oh, really yes. like on oh, fire yes. and ready they to were, beat each other. They were, they were, they were all way. fighting, fighting to win. And of yeah. course, the winners are our clients that yeah. that have the food they need, and that's what it's all about. Yes. You know, we don't want our neighbors to go hungry, and especially. Absolutely you not. guys have another great campaign as we, again we kind of end the, the near of um, get to the end of summer here but backpacks for kids and kind of explain how this works and it's healthy not hungry healthy, right not hungry bags it is a it's a bag of food designed to feed a child for about a week parents are struggling it's mm -hmm. difficult they're home for the summer and we do not and I know our, our whole community does not want children to go hungry I know um, so we sell, we started this program and it's a it's again it's a it's a bag of food designed to feed a child for about a week um, and uh, parents can come in they can get a bag per child okay um, while school is, is out of session and so again there's about two weeks left about this two is weeks still... left okay about two weeks left um, and we have given away over a thousand of those bags over wow. the summer, so a lot of children have been helped. It really makes a difference. It so, really are you still looking for kids. donations for these Absolutely. bags to make sure that we can yes. have enough for the next two weeks? Absolutely. So, what kind of foods are you looking for? As as one of my volunteers mentioned, a jar of jelly is is the equivalent to gold. Yeah, <laughs> in I know. our center. Yeah, um, that so and peanut butter. <laughs> peanut I would butter imagine. and jelly. There, that's always a welcome okay. thing. We give a whole box of cereal. Um, again, it's designed to feed a child for about a week. Mm -hmm. A box of cereal is going to feed them every day um, for a week, so they get a whole box of cereal. Cereal, that's that's equivalent to yeah. gold. Um, and anything, you know, like microwavable macaroni and cheese, okay. anything. And we really stress making them as healthy as possible. So we want we want our kids to be healthy because then in the mm -hmm. long run, yeah. um, that costs us less than it does in the beginning if we if, if we can keep them healthy. Well, and so. I love that you were telling me in the commercial break too that things that are, you know, gently cooking. Gently cooked, yes. Uh, things, which I totally get because you don't want the kids having to fire up the stove and the no, oven and, you know, no, things that they yes. maybe can put in the microwave and that's easy My, to yes, do. Yes, yes. So that's, a, that's the kids that are able to do that, you know, microwave yeah. and those kind of things. Um, nutrition bars, anything like that yeah. is welcome for those bags too. As we kind of close here and as the summer closes of this, uh, you guys have been doing the Save Our Summer event, um, you know, what do you want people to know and really, you know, take home with them as they're listening this morning and maybe if they, you know, still have an opportunity, still have the heart to help? Yes. Uh, well, there's a very easy way to donate. You can go to feedthecape.com mm -hmm. and make a donation and um, we still have a little bit of summer left yeah. and, and it, as it, if you can walk into our center mm -hmm. and see the kind of the empty shelves, um, you would know that we need those donations. Yeah. Um, it's it's been a it's been a strong, wonderful summer with lots of donations, but we still you still we, need we more. Still, yes, we still need more. We still and even need just more. as the summer ends too, and you go into fall, you're still going to need donations and volunteers. And uh, people to have check used out. their money for um, for back to school, and so we need to make sure yep. that they that they have food to feed their children. Julie, so. thank you so much oh, for being here you. this morning. Congratulations on the event, and yes. uh, thank you for all that you do in our community. Oh, we thank appreciate you so it. much. I appreciate it, Carly. Thank all right, you. we'll send it over to Steph. Up next, crafting with kids. How you can decorate on a dime making schoolhouses for the little ones. And this crafty idea was even endorsed by actress and mom, Jennifer Gardner. Stay with us.